Hello everyone, I'm Phoenix Tremaine. Today I'm going to be giving you the Bowling Booth Spoilers for the week of September the 6th. But first, if you haven't done so, please take a minute to subscribe and hit that like button so YouTube sends more people our way. Also, uh, we have a membership where you get exclusive videos, early access to videos, and more. Um, my recipes and you get to get a shout out only in the spoiler videos. But that's what I'm about to do right now because it's going to take about 30 seconds. To thank Michael Pryor, Jeff Payton, Brian McConaughey, Phyllis Pearson, Ramona Newsom, Ariane Enos, Gwen Marie, Kiki Landry, Janet Lotta, Sandra Crawford, Omar Ramirez, Roger Smith, Artemis Hill, Marilyn Finn, Riri Carter, Sim Sims, Josh Hurst, Sherry Williams, Shannon Clark, DD, Rose Garden Design, Cheryl Beecher, Heather Kite, Patricia Bazzano, Jay Ponza, Red Butterfly 50 Irish, Kelly Banks, Vanessa Sanders, Little Squirrel Russell, Megan Maloney, BBW Women, and David Meadows. Thank you all for being part of the membership. So here we go with uh, the bold and beautiful spoilers for the week of the six. Beginning with Monday, Labor Day, uh, Finn gets emotional when Sheila suddenly faints. Eric gains a new perspective while eavesdropping on Sean and Quinn. Tuesday, September 7th, Zenday receives an unexpected earful from Paris about Steffi and Finn. Things become tense when Steffi accuses Sheila of faking her illness. Wednesday, September the 8th, Zenday attempts to get Paris to admit that she is crushing on Finn. Sheila ups the ante with Steffi by showing her the emoji text Finn sent. <laughs> Thursday, September the 9th, Eric spots Quinn and Carter having an intimate conversation. Sheila's plot to wreak havoc between Steffi and Finn is fully in motion. I'm sorry, fully in motion. And then we finally have Friday, uh, September 10th, where Eric romances Quinn with dinner and a dance. Torn between the two, Finn makes a big decision about his birth mother and his wife. So that should be good. Um, let me know in the comments section if you're enjoying uh, The Bold and the Beautiful, um, these new storylines. Eric, uh, Quinn, and Carter's story would be my favorite. Uh, Finn, Sheila, and Steffi will come in second. Um, I don't... This whole Zenday Paris Finn stuff, I could do without. Um, and Ridge and, and Brooke need to get a life instead of worrying about what uh, Eric and, and Quinn are doing in their marriage. So, they need to butt out. But other than that, um, and Shauna needs a storyline. Give Shauna a storyline. Uh, so... And thank you for not having flow anywhere near the spoilers or in anything in any major capacity uh, for months. And that includes, um, and if we had to sacrifice Wyatt's storyline, they, if they're going to keep him with that boring character who, who's not acting uh, or can't act, um, she's got plenty of time to take acting lessons. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. All this time off from Bold and Beautiful, she should be enrolled in acting school you already got the job now if only you could learn how to show emotion and inflections uh, we'd be in business otherwise both and beautiful just shows you the bikini most of the time but anyway thank you for watching let me know what you think about uh, bold and beautiful these new storylines uh, for the fall that are coming through and I will see you in the next video